and welcome to you to Vegas, where they do it bigger and better than any other city when it comes to the big time fights. We're at the Thomas and Mack Center for our main event. 10 rounds of heavyweight action. Great atmosphere here tonight. You talk to everybody ringside, and they expect this one to be a barn burner. Bishop's approaching the ring now, and this ring walk can tell you so much. Look at the focus on his face. Nichols is making his way to the ring, and I know you're used to seeing many ring walks where guys are really jacked up. This isn't one of them. In the blue corner, hailing out of Philadelphia, Andre Gisha. His adversary, fighting out of Atlanta, Kobe Nichols. Remember, guys, obey my commands at all times. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch them up. Round number one is now underway. All the talk is done. It is simply time to fight. Lance flush with the two-punch combo by Andre Bishop. Nice strike after catching one by Kobe Nichols. Big puncher here in front of us, going up against a guy who can do a little bit of everything. A boxer, puncher, well-skilled, good athlete, well-conditioned. Yeah, the big punch, I think, is going to be in trouble, especially as the fight goes late. He's going to get more and more desperate, and he's going to look for that one bomb. And usually, when you know it's coming, you can avoid it. Combo lands to the head. You know Andre Bishop's trainer is going to be really thrilled to see him do that there. He doesn't want to see his fighter get hit too much tonight. That was a nice block. Good block by Andre Bishop that time. He'd like to see more of that. Nichols' right hand scores well. Well, something's got to stick. He sends the combination to the body. Nichols is stunned by that shot. Good scoring shot. It was a straight right. Big shot. Nichols is unable to stand up to that combination. And if he wants to stay up, he's going to have to grab on, kill a little time. Well timed by Nichols. He took a step back, landed the counterpunch. Exactly what he wanted to do. Great work offensively landing that combination by Andre Bishop. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Kobe Nichols. Nichols is so dangerous with that accuracy. A two-punch combination landing. A stinging uppercut by Andre Bishop. And the bell rings, signifying the end of the round. Bishop's coming off a round where he scored big. He scored the knockdown. I suppose right now he's got to think to himself, Teddy, how did I do that, and how can I do that again? He should think that. Well, that's a tough moment for Andre Bishop right now. He's hurt. I can hear his... Look at that! Is this the end for Andre Bishop now? He has some questions to answer after being floored by that power punch.
Bishop's going to keep taking this test, rising up after being knocked down. The other day when we were talking to Andre Bishop, he said to have success in this fight, I have to land combinations. He landed a good one there. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss. Big shot there. Andre Bishop once again will have to dig deep. Bishop goes down yet again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So he was knocked down, but Andre Bishop is proving that he doesn't want to be knocked out tonight. Keep those hands up. Good double jab by Nickel. Oh, you could feel that one to the gut by Kobe Nichols. How about a return to sender with the left hand? A crushing two-punch combo by Kobe Nichols. Now he goes to the gut with a right hand. a razor-sharp uppercut by Andre Bishop. Nichols is showing you that sublime skill right now with that two-punch combo. Hard to believe they can still give like this in these final moments of what has been a sensational round. I feel like I'm back at the amusement park on a roller coaster again, like a kid. He comes back with the left hand again. One. Good work by Andre Bishop. Good flush shot. Up. Oh, a big shot comes home for him. That was a big oh, shot that Florida, that and it's a good. big shot that made ends it right here. That looked like the great pitch of Great Maddox. His sinker ball. Boy, it went down quick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. over fight is over Nichols's corner is already celebrating his opponent unable to beat the count Teddy there's a lot of explaining to do here but help me with this was this early knockout on a left field a product of one guy being prepared and the other guy just not ready for it no obviously he wasn't ready wasn't prepared in the gym but I think he came out cold from the locker room never knew what hit him for Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Always enjoy you tuning in. We'll see you next time at the fights.